Welcome back, Random TV Reviews, your girl in that. And your boy, Stanley. Listen, it took everything in me just to get that out. I promise you this was a snooze fest. I don't know if anybody else felt like that. And at this point in my life, I'm almost hitting 40. So keeping me up past 9 o'clock on a work day is tough. And you mean to tell me, Tyler, I know you're trying to move on to bigger and better things, but don't be leaving us here with this bull skip. Yeah. I don't have time, and the only reason I'm making time is because I love you all. Me and Tyler right now, we're not, we not cool. Because yeah. this is stupid. Yeah. This is, it's just starting not to make any sense. It's, it's called like it's all over the place. Yeah, it's called Elevator 7. I'm not going to talk about Wyatt. Let's just put it this way. Wyatt at home and he's still fiending. Still feeling the charm and get some puss from that lady. Anna. So we don't know where Anna's angle is because you know Oscar gave her an offer that he said you probably don't want to refuse. Okay, whatever. We're not going to yeah. talk about it. Because that's the scene that I literally was like, Stanley, yeah. come in. Because we yeah. were like sleep. Yeah, because she was like, I was at it for 10 years. And he was like, wow. Don't even make no, like Mark B said, don't even matter. It don't even matter. So. We start off where we left off at last week where Demonica had came and sat her tail down at the table with um, David and Erica. David said, uh-uh, we're not doing this today. <laughs> come with me, come with me. <laughs> Demonica said, um, I'm not coming with you and don't put your hands on me. Erica said, oh, you don't want him to put your hands on you? He puts his hands, hands on, on me, me and I like it. Sexually. <laughs> and I said, you know what, ooh. <laughs> So Demonica said, listen, little girl, didn't I tell you that a hurricane was a here coming and that you need to take cover? Where's your mama big old titty bitties that you can hide up up under? And, and even need, that. You ain't gonna be safe. So listen what? here, get up out my face, little girl. Let me talk to my husband. David said, listen, let's go. Let's go to the elevator. Yeah, let's, let's do, run. Let's, let's go. take cover. Let's take cover before we have to choke this so they end up going to the elevator, getting in the elevator. And this is when Demonica, see, this is what gets on my nerves. We like a good villain. We really, really, really do. Mm -hmm. But this right here, this is too much. <laughs> this is too much for one person to be getting away with. It's like watching the black, crazier version of Donald Trump. Just running all amok. Doing whatever the fuck they want to do yeah. with no repercussions. Exactly. Don't that sound? Pennsylvania Avenue. Nobody won't put the pimp hand down. I was like, David, this is your opportunity. The, the camera in the corner is turned just like on pile. <laughs> Man, the camera don't work. Take your hand and smack the skit right <laughs> out of her. Smack her right out of that tight you black can't, dress. Can't smack a woman, man. Get she Erica ain't a woman. Get she Erica ain't ain't a woman. She's a <laughs> demon. She's the devil. So if you ain't smack. Matter of fact, take your hand like this and put it on the back of Erica's hand like this. That's how you, you do it. Bow. Because <laughs> technically, I didn't hit her. I ain't hit you. She did. So she's standing there at the elevator door. She's basically like, y'all not going to leave out of this elevator. David said, what? What, what is it that you what, want? What else do you want from me? <laughs> I done gave you everything. Money, car, houses. What do you want? She said, blood. I want to make your life a living hell. David said, well, you doing that? Yeah, you already doing that. <laughs> she was like, but it ain't enough. I'm just going to make every last um, five of your being hell. And I'm saying here like, you didn't want this man. You tried to burn him up. Let's yeah. not forget, you tried to burn him up in a house. And then, David will turn around and tell her, say, listen, all of that that you're talking about right here and me sleeping with her ain't got nothing to do with nothing because you, you were having an affair with Benny Young. Benjamin Young, yeah. She said, I still am. She said, matter of fact, when I'm done here, I'm going up over there. He said, why don't you go ahead and do that? Erica had had enough by this moment. She had took her own pocketbook and hit the goddamn camera and turned it to the <laughs> side. And David said, listen, mm -mm, mm, don't trade places said, with what I've been through. He said, we, 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 we can't do this tonight. <laughs> no. So Demonica said, go ahead, hit me. Hit me so I can press charge her. She said, oh, I'm not going to hit you. So then I think I said, Erica, well, what you do all that for? But you know that's a puss move. 
People always do to hit me so I can press charge again. No, if you want me to hit you, you hit me back. Let's have a freaking fight. Fair <laughs> God darn square. If you want to knock up, let's knock up and forget the popo. So next thing we know, Erica was like, mm, let me go ahead and give you a show. So she all up on David and uh -huh. they kissing and they caressing and they doing all this. And Demonica's over there just going crazy. And you spinning me around me? I'm you sorry. Spin back. <laughs> I got you. Said, don't touch him. Don't touch him. Get off of him. And the next thing we know, we saw this is what happens when a billion dollars on the elevator. That guy doing Demonica would try to beat the hell out she, of Erica. She took but, the first joint. But Erica would go right back out. And David in the middle get ready to have him yeah, with he, guy doing the geriatric heart attack. He, 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 still, 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 <laughs> still. <laughs> I say, you know what? That was the funniest part of the video. It was funny, but I was so I was looking for some blues though. They were just eating and trying to snatch. It's trying to snatch off each other's wig. Say so y'all know y'all got that guy doing got to be glued on there, ain't coming off. <laughs> so so next thing we know, David said, I, uh, uh he pressed the buttons for um, security. security on the elevator. They said, is there a problem? He said, we stuck. Demonica gets on, see, this is where she started pissing me off again. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, they're attacking me. Yeah, David, stop me. hitting me, stop hitting me. She just putting on a got on show. When they finally hit the, um, the lobby, David and Erica just walk on out like this crazy winch. She laying down in the floor, kicking and screaming, ah! and gets up like, Security came over and said, can I help you with something? You're a little too late. He said, you winch. I was over there trying to eat my cot on Big Mac from Burger King. He was wide, buddy. <laughs> and you done call me up over here? Uh-huh. Say, I, my special sauce going to be cold by the time I get back. <laughs> so then we see Landon and um, President Charles, um, President Char elect. Charles um, Obama. Charles Obama. And he's basically trying to give him pointers on his next speech. Blah, 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 whatever. And... Obama notices that Landon is a little bit everything on edge. He, everything he say, he was correcting it. He said, you know what? Is there something we, we need to talk about? Landon said, we'll talk about it in private when we get a chance. He dismissed everybody. Everybody, said, everybody out. We, need, we can talk right now. What's going on? He says, see the lady that you was with, Candace Young? I know her. I know her for her works. Yeah. And she blackmails good old men like yourself. Mm hmm So I suggest you to stay away from her. He said, well, I knew all that. He said, mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm good with all of it. He said, for real? So then he shows him his iPad. He said, so you you know all about that. Um, this escort, escort service? Yeah, you went to the escort service? He said, uh-huh, it was years ago. He said, listen, let me tell you this. He said, she's going to be around. I'm going to keep her around. And your job? It's to clean her up. Clean her up. And matter of fact, I'm going to bring her to the inauguration. It's like, I'm like, now I'm confused. I said, did she put it on you that good? Yeah, that got you? I, I'm confused. Or you just like the thrill? It got Like, me. all of them I, like the thrill, though. I, I don't, I, yeah. I, so then it was like, what the buck? Like, what? Just, he said, you can't afford. You don't you know this is going to be on ABC, NBC, Fox and C News. Fox News, and CNN. Everybody's going to see this. That's not going to look good for your image there, player. He said, I pay you good money, and they said you're the best. Clean it up. Make Clean it, it up. go away. And teach her how to command a room. Mm -hmm. Teach her how to float around in these parts. I say, shoot, Candace don't need to teach you that. She no, got, she, she can teach know. you. Yeah, she already know how to do that. So then we see Landon, when he leaves out the room, he gets on the telephone, and I swore he called the police. It said, Candace Young, the one you looking for, I know where she at. She over here at this hotel room, da da da. And I said, dude, you ain't seen Chucky yet, have you? Because <laughs> I'm quite sure if he had experienced Chucky, he wouldn't have did that right. No. Nah. And at the same time, it's, that still ain't gonna work because he don't he don't know that the Secret Service already came in on her. So you put him us calling the people that were just in the room to let her go. True. So that ain't gonna work. Mm -hmm. So then we see Mama Rose. I'm having a bad, bad day. She is. It's pissed. about time she to be is. She is pissed off. She got 20 on 10 for no reason. She is mad off of you could have shot my grandson. Yeah, you didn't shoot him. You almost... Because you pulled the trigger, I'm going to kill your tail. <laughs> so he's, she was like, um, Jim, found him yet? Jim said, nope, I ain't I, found I, him I yet. I need some more time. Jim always need more time. Except for when he is his, his, his turn. He always needs some more time. You're supposed to be a judge. You're supposed to be on time. So Mama Rose said, well, I can't find him neither. 
Jim said, you know what, Mama Rose? I got one more favor to ask you. She said, mm mm, mm, mm. <laughs> You out of um, favors with me and my family. Yeah. He said, but did you realize how many times I put my, um, stuck my dick out there for you on the bench? Your family and you? She said, mm-hmm. I do. Mm -hmm. But even that ain't enough right here, right here. Yeah. You, you, I said, you, you want me to start calling off how many times I've been there for you? She said, you know what, Jim? No more favors. I'm about to do something. He said, uh, my rose, my rose, my rose said. He said, blue cup? She said, let me go ahead, hang up this phone while my Estee Lauder still looks a little fresh. <laughs> so He was trying his best to find out, can you, can you please let me know what you're going to do? Mm -mm. Click up. So then we see Hannah, she down at the police station because, you know, last week she found out that Bennett was down there. They won't tell her nothing. Nope. That's a typical. Mm -hmm. Don't say nothing. So then she asked for Justin. Justin comes out there and tells her, say, hey, he's back there. He's being questioned for um, Chris and Maxwell's murder, and I believe that he's going to be charged for that murder as well. Mm -hmm. Hannah said, let me please talk to him. She, he said, even if I could do that. I can't. He and they being questioned by Secret Service. She was like, Secret, Secret Service? Service? What kind of bullshit is going on here? He was like, hey, don't know, don't show about what happened to the boys in the hood. So, yeah. he back at, ain't nothing I can do, so I can't help you. So, Hannah calls Catherine, told Catherine, said, hey, Secret Service got my boy. I need your help. She was like, Secret Service? Service. She said, I'm coming down there now. I was like, yeah. you know what? So, then back in the interrogation room, Benny is talking there talking to what's the guy's name? Um, what was that? Uh, Agent Agent Davis. Davis, yeah. And Agent Davis was like, you know what? Let's go ahead and cut the bullshit. You being real railroaded. railroaded. And he was like, it don't make no sense, but it is what it is. So, so Benny you said, pissed off some people in high places. And they about to pin this diamond heist on you. <laughs> you remember that? <laughs> All about the Benjamins. <laughs> he said, Benny said, can I please use your phone, man? My mama's out there. I, I no, he said I need to call my mom. Agent Davis said, your mama been out there. I said, well, how, how you know did he that? know that? But you know what? They had them little earpieces. But I don't want them seeing no earpieces. Yeah, yeah. Yes. We just talked. It's Tyler. It's yeah, Tyler. he messed up. He, you know, the prop, you forgot the earpiece prop. <laughs> just like you forget the IV bags and all that stuff, too. Yeah, oh, yeah. My allergies are kicked up tonight, so I'm sorry. So, um, he, um, Bennett keeps asking him, said, man, I need to talk to my mama. I know she worried sick about me. I'm a mama's boy. Let me he use your and I said, is he setting them up? Because the way he was punching them numbers, and he was like looking at him like, yeah, that's a good set of prints right there. Mm. I said, what did Angel Davis do? But Angel Davis let him use the phone. He tried to call Hannah. Hannah had that church um, uh, voicemail. <laughs> it's Hannah. Leave a message. I said, wonder she had, <laughs> um, had um, a ring back tone. We fall <laughs> down. <laughs> we get up. Oh. So he, he hung up from there. Then he called Mitch. Davis was like, oh, oh. Hmm. Mitch was like, what's up, Benny? He said, hey, my mama down here. I need you to come down here and get, get my mama. Now. Mitch said, hey, I'm a little tired gotta, up right now. This I got to go down to the restaurant and say, he said, grandma is on one, one tonight. So I got to stay close <laughs> to make sure that she don't turn up the way that she really going to turn up. And he was like, look, get down here to my mama. Benny. I mean, Mitch was like, listen, I took and told you my grandma is on one. <laughs> I get there when I get there. <laughs> and that's basically how that went. So then we see David and Erica. I guess he finished busting that mm, all kinds of nuts like mm -hmm. the college twins were saying. Said knock him right on out. And she don't put his butt to bed. Her telephone rings. I thought it was war. I thought actually. it was too. But it was Candace. Candace said, you know what? That hookup you had with cell phone. Yeah, I need, I need to get that I cell phone that. for $100. Hook Erica's me up. still talking about some. Where are you? What she asked, I mean, she asked some stupid questions. Candace said, what's what? up with all the questions? Yeah. Just get me a phone. And I said, <clears throat> nobody is going to tell this girl that her son did. Yep. And like somebody, I think Lady Nigga said it too. Cause Earth, she don't have know. no maternal. Yeah, she, Earth, yeah, Earth, no, yeah, right? yeah. she has no maternal instincts at all. That nothing's wrong with her son. Yeah. This is unfreaking believable. Listen, yeah. I bought the ingredients for Lil Quincy's God doing repass. I'm going to have to freeze this bull skit because yeah. they may have to put him on ice again yeah. for his mama to be notified. Yeah, matter of fact, by the time Catherine paid for the casket in the funeral, the price is going to go up. Yeah, ain't lying. So, um, Inflation. 
Barry Wider gonna put some um, interest on that goddamn body. Shoot, the stock market gonna fall, inflation gonna go up, and the cash gonna be double the price. You ain't lying. By the time they get finished with this bullshit. Said, what the hell is going on? So, Erica was like, you know what? I'll get you the phone. She was like, you know what? Where David at? Oh, he, I put him in the bed. And she said, and you on the phone talking to me? Like, well, he's, yeah, get off of this get phone. phone. Yeah. Didn't I teach you better than this? And then Erica started playing with the phone like she Texting was contemplating somebody. something. Didn't get it. Don't care right now. Don't but even it matter. Is, like Mike yeah. B said, it don't, don't even, even matter. matter. But Erica said, you know what? I really wanted your room number because I wanted to tell you about the demonica fight that I got into. She was like, you know what, hon? Leave that alone. Yeah, leave and her that alone. That crazy right there is way out of your She's on a whole nother level right there. So Erica was like, no, I'm I'm from the streets too. She was like, nope, you ain't from these streets. Yeah. These streets right here, you know, it's got padded walls. You ain't about that kind of life. Yeah. So then we see Jeffrey. Jeffrey goes down to the hotel lobby to sit down. And who is down there but Landon? And as soon as Landon sees him, Lord have mercy. Mm, mm, mm. Justin all over again. I said, Lord. So he said, oh, you want a drink? He said, you know what? Might as well make it a double. He said, yeah. So we can have sex afterwards. Mm -hmm. Say, mm. He said, boy, you the best I ever had. That body of yours, that butt, you know what you doing. He said, come on, man. Let's just go. I said, God, don't want Jeff. Said, what Jeffrey, you what you doing? Do? Jeffrey said, I, I gotta go. I don't have time. Yeah, I'm gone. I got murder on my mind. Yeah. I got dead bodies on my mind. I got my crazy mama on my mind. And my daddy is sleeping with a girl that's my age on my mind. I and don't then, know. And then Landon told me, you know what? Let's get some doubles. We'll need some shots. Jeffrey like, I'm gone. Mm -hmm. So then Jeffrey walks his tail to the elevator. And I said, okay, Jeffrey. If you really ain't want this boy to be following you, you could have made a scene in that lobby mm -hmm. and he would have stopped. Turn around and yell, leave me alone. So when the elevator, I said, Lord have mercy, how many scenes we gonna see in this elevator? Elevator door closed and Landon almost tried to rape him mm -hmm. in the back. In he the, saw, he the saw the camera, he said the camera turned he anybody here, look up. Ain't nobody gonna see us. And he started going, going down, down on him and I was like, Landon, come on Trying now. to rape him? Like, come on now. So they finally get off the elevator um, Jeffrey's trying to go to his room. He gets to the room and Landon, he all, you know, that drunk thing. Uh -huh. <laughs> and then say we know Jeffrey gets his door open. And Justin Timberlake is in the, bed, in the bed naked. On the bar naked. Justin, you can't even be mad for being exposed this time because you did. Yeah, you don't open yourself up. Jeffrey told you to go home and when he want to see you again, he'll call you. You broke into his room and got in his yeah, bed. So how naked. the hell did he get in there? That's my question. The same way that girl got in Chris Brown's house and was in the bathtub and cooked that breakfast. <laughs> Cause if he went downstairs and no joker gave him got no key to Jeffrey's room, somebody going to jail. Well, who gonna put him in jail? He's a cop. Yeah. You know how that works. Yeah. So then the next thing we know, we see this this Enterprise rental van. Uh -huh. Pull up, to, pull up to the radio station. It was in the um, radio yeah. TV station. One of them. And just chunks of body out there. Woof. Like so, like a slab of ribs. Uh -huh. <laughs> Hit the ground. I said, is that Detective Salisbury State? Yes, it was Detective Salisbury State. But why was it that when they chalked her body out there on the asphalt, there was somebody walking across the parking lot. Do -do 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 saw the body. <laughs> Seriously, so you had to get all the way up on the body to realize that, that, that was, was a body, body wrapped yeah. up in saran wrap like that, like it was leftover ribs, and she was black, and it had a note on it that said Jennifer Salison, crying victim. victim. I said, I'm like y'all, y'all taking it on that level, Mama Malone, you that patty. I'm <laughs> <laughs> all y'all the been through. So she she said I don't play with my grandson. She, she, she said she don't play. Miss said, Grandma on one tonight. Oh, he she on one. She throwing she throwing dead bodies out there with the cry's name on it. It's about ready to get real. Mm -hmm. I don't even I have guess. Any, I don't even know. I, to I guess. Up. Yeah. Unless they let us write it. Yeah. Let yeah, let us write it. I'm I'm really ready for this to phase out now. I Yeah, it's it's, it's done, it done took its course 
It was good from season one on up until what is season no, one? No, it hadn't been good since three. Yeah. When Spin off. When Candace was a bad B. Yeah, season one and two was all chain. Yeah. But y'all, thank you all for everybody that's been concerned about me. Y'all saw my little boot and all that stuff, my foot brace and all that good stuff. Ain't nothing wrong. I'm just flat footed as hell. And I'm I insist on wearing four inch heels or Chuck Taylors. Mm -hmm. And both of them buck my feet up. <laughs> so I had to end up getting an injection in my foot and I have to wear this boot in order for the medicine to do what it's supposed to do. But I feel much, much better. But I have been on prednisone. And if anybody knows anything about prednisone, I have been eating like a 300 pound man <laughs> for an entire week. Thank yeah. God I haven't gained any weight though. Yeah, and you took the last one today. So. I took the last one today, but I feel like a 300 pound man. Like I feel like I could just go to a buffet and crush it, you know? <laughs> just eat all the food up. Oh, no, just pull my chair up to the buffet. Just, just, and just eat like a... Yeah, just like that. So yeah, I'm good y'all. So thank you all for your concern or whatever. But I'm straight from the VA. The dirty, dirty south. Sue up, Sue's on. Holla. Holla.